for the end of the final two events of the season. It's time for the final two events. Welcome to season the football. Hello everyone and welcome to JPL Cup Season 2, Event 19, the football match. Two teams will go up against each other. Try to score from the other side as much as you can. The team that scores more will move on. This is a 1v1 event. The team that wins will move on to the next round. Until only two will remain fighting for gold. As you will see from the explanation, it's about shooting it to the other side's team. Four marbles from each side will roll down. Another one is supposed to be in the goal, trying to stop it from going in. As the committee has lost to the test team. We're going from first against last. So Whitecaps against 13 Colonies for match number one. Down they go. And nobody manages to score. That's nail-nail after the match. Now... This will only be for one round, so if there is a tie, it goes immediately to tiebreaker. As we're going to tiebreaker number one, and that is two goals for the 13 colonies. And that will be enough to let them move on to the quarterfinals. The Whitecaps are already out. They do manage to push it to a tiebreaker, but it's not a good score. Losing by two goals is a lot. Let's see what the rest of the teams have to offer. Ghost Crabs and High Ballers up next. Not a lot of shots managed to get out, but one manages to be scored by the Ghost Crabs, which will put them in the next round, and the High Ballers are eliminated. Ghost Crabs doing what needs to be done and winning the match. Just doing enough. And conserving energy, maybe, for the next match against the 13 Colonies. Up next, Furious Fireworks and the Spices. Down they come, and that is one goal for each side. No winner yet. 1-1. One, one. And that means we're going to a tiebreaker. Again, we're just going to keep going until somebody wins. And everything resets again. Here they come. And that is, again, one goal each. So we're still tied to all. We keep on rolling once again. Furious Fireworks and Spices still trying to win it. And again, it's just the round of 16. We still have a lot of time to go. We would like to not use all the energy immediately. But Furious Fireworks is more and they will enjoy a win for free. And the Furious Fireworks will move on. Spices are eliminated. And so more and more teams being kicked out of this event, being left out of a championship dream. By this point, you just want to win as much as you can, especially now that Whitecaps have already lost. And it is 1-1. No, Sugar Crush managed to score again, and Valdivians are out. 2-1, and that's enough to win. Sugar Crush will move on. Great job, Valdivians, not enough defensive play, and it cost them. They are out of this event, and this will probably kick them out of a championship dream. As next up, Resuming Zebras and the Knights of Night. And not many shots have been shot out. Knights of Night almost scored, but couldn't quite get it in. So we have a tiebreaker. We will now switch sides. Again, close but amazing defensive play from the Zebras. They managed to keep it clean, but they can't manage to keep it clean again as the Knights of Night score and will move on once again. The Knights of Night, they see a chance of a lifetime to win as hosts. Something that's rarely been done by anybody in a marble competition and it could be done today by the Knights. Silver Bullets and Brightening Napweed up next. Can anyone score? No. Clean game, clean defensive play from both teams. No goals. As we're ready to roll again. Napweed and Bullets. And that is one goal for each side. Yes! One goal for each side. We keep going once again. Nobody can get the decisive win just yet. We keep on rolling some more. Tiebreaker number two between the Silver Bullets and Brightening Napweed. Down they come. And that is one goal for the Silver Bullets. And that is it. Silver Bullets, 2-1. The 
they will win the match and will move on. Brightening Napweed also out of this event. Not good for them if they want to push for a potential win, but it is what it is. Cherry Clouds and Maple Leaves up next. And that is one goal, two goals actually for the Cherry Clouds. That is a two to nothing victory and they will cruise to the next round. Phenomenal job from the Cherry Clouds. They're on to the quarterfinals and the Maple Leaves, they are done. They are done for this event and one more team will join them. The Sapphire Spirals or Team Bla and that is one goal, two one to the Team Bla. Team Bla winning two to one over the Sapphire Spirals who just can't quite do enough. They managed to get a late goal mostly as a consolation goal probably also for the consolation cup by the looks of things but let's hope for the best for them as we have the bottom eight ready to roll to the quarterfinals ghost crabs and 13 colonies down they come and that is one goal for the 13 colonies and that will be enough to put them in the semi-finals after a disastrous season so far for the 13 colonies they are trying trying to fight for any point at this point just to maybe save themselves from auto relegation. Sugar Crash and Furious Fireworks up next. And yes, a very late goal by Furious Fireworks. And that is enough to get them the win. Furious Fireworks will win and will move on to the semi-finals. And that means that Sugar Crash are done for this event. That means we're going to get 13 colonies and the Furious Fireworks matching up in the semis but first the other two quarterfinal matches silver bullets and knights of night and that is one goal each we keep going silver bullets and knights of night we've both been the top teams in the last season one of them still is in this one silver bullets not so much but we would love to show that we still got it and do they let's find out they just missed this shot and concede a goal so maybe not but the Knights of Night most definitely do. They move on again. Knights of Night will win this match and will eliminate the Silver Bullets and will keep on trying to get closer, as close as they can, to the White Cups. Team Bla and Cherry Clouds up next. Is this going in for the Cherry for Team Bla? Yes, it is. One one. One goal each. Team Bla barely managed to score as we go to a tiebreaker. Cherry Clouds and Team Bla again and it's one goal here for the Cherry Clouds. Two goals for the Cherry Clouds. Okay, so that's a 3-1 victory. And the Cherry Clouds will move on once again. Team Bla also out. So most of the big teams are already eliminated. Two teams. Actually, three big teams are still left. It's just the 13 colonies and a few title contenders. Speaking of which, here come the 13 colonies. And they managed to tie it. Does it go in? No. 1-1. One, one. Furious Fireworks and 13 colonies keeping it even. No one able to get what they need for a win. So here we go for a tiebreaker. Here they roll down. One goal for 13 colonies. And that is it. 13 colonies to the finals and for the first time ever 13 colonies will get a top to finish in an event it's about time it took them almost 40 events to do so but here it finally is 13 colonies a top two finisher but who will they face in the finals between the cherry clouds and the knights of night both teams taking shots but nothing going in yet no goals in the first attempt we're going once again both teams want their spot in the finals. They're both desperate for a few points. This could be Cherry Cloud's last chance to still run for the championship. And this could be the Knights of Night putting a lot of pressure on the Whitecaps. But so far, again, nobody managing to get what needs to be done in order to win the match. Amazing defensive play once again from both sides. No goals scored. All of them, both teams 
really want their spot in the finals. But who will get it? Some shots taken, and it is a win for the Czech Cloud. 2-1, and they will be in the finals. After a few shaky results throughout the season, it's good to see that they can clutch it out, and they do manage to return to the podium after a very long drought. But for bronze medal, Knights of Night and Furious Fireworks, who will get the bronze? And it is enough, just one goal, but the Knights of Night will take the bronze. The pressure by the Knights is not over yet as we get one more medal for the season. They could even get another one in the next one, but they managed to get a bronze today. But who will get gold between the Cherry Clouds and the 13 Colonies? Down they come! Taking the shots, one goal for Cherry Clouds! And that is it! The Cherry Clouds, with one goal, have won their first gold medal of the season! The Cherry Clouds win the football event. Phenomenal job from the Cherries. They will live today as gold medalists. And with happiness in their face, at long last, they return to form. 13 Colonies also get the silver, Knights of Night with the bronze. And now with this, only the top four can win. Cherry Clouds, Team Blum, Knights of Night and Whitecaps. Who will be the champion between these four teams? Only time will tell. We hope to see you for the final event, the lap race. Let's see you then. And until then, don't forget to keep on rolling.